and welcome to our winter break extravaganza part one our first Christmas morning we have three Christmases and we had our first one um, with our mom's side of the family she is going to do a Christmas haul like what she got for Christmas haul part one I am going to save all the presents I get out of all the Christmases that I do and do a giant haul at the end so you'll see her in parts in the vlogs and you'll see mine in one whole video so, she's just going to go get started. Let's do this thing. The first gift that I got is... I got this soccer ornament. It is like a wooden plate thing. It is actually carved. My bad. And I love soccer, so I love this. So, I'm going to put it on my tree. So, the next gift that I got is... This thing, it can be a scarf, headband, hair tie, you can, even if, like, it's also a ski mask, so oh, you can do all kinds of things with. The next gift is, oh, whoops, so I love Hatchimals, uh-huh, so I got, I got these two little one packs, this one, say I'm going to do a separate video. I'm going to do a separate video of opening all my Hatchimal stuff, but I'm just going to show you what the eggs look like inside. So this is the first egg. It has bright blue dots. And then I got another one. It looks like the exact same, but this has light purple spots. Next thing I got is ooh, Hatchimal stickers. It has... Six pages and it has 120 stickers in it. So, yeah. Then the next gift is super cute. I got this from my cousin. It is a dog stuffed down named him Max and I call him Maxie. So. Actually, actually I named him Max. The next thing I got is, ooh, I got a four pack Hatchimal set. It's actually a five pack because it comes with an exclusive, and I will be opening this in a separate video. So watch that. Um, this is a soccer thing. It is something that can wrap around your waist and also your ball, and then you can kick it, and it will come right back to you. And you can practice receiving it, um, passing it, and shooting it so I can't wait to look at this. Next gift is a Hatchimal case. It, it looks like an egg and it has like like the shape of a little nest down here and it looks like an egg. It has a little handle right here and it can open like this. So it came with two eggs and it has six little hidden crystal nests. It is very, very good quality. And okay, so there's two more gifts and they are going to be the biggest. Bring it in. Woo! I got the secret scene. Hatchimal secret scene. And if you look into this hole, into the light, you can see what you got. It's okay, and then say so you open it. So yeah. So I will open this in the Hatchimal video. So the next one is going to be the biggest one that I got. So, Woo! okay. I so, keep saying woo. So I got the um tropical party playset. It ha it comes with two exclusive Hatchimals. It has all this cool fun stuff. It has some water. It even has a. Um, a concession stand. So I'll also be opening this one in the Hatchimal video. So, okay, so we are just hanging out now, and I did say that I wouldn't do anything of my Christmas haul, like, to today, but I really wanted to make slime. So, one of the things I got is this rainbow slimy gloop slime kit, and I'm just gonna make slime. So, 
Um, that's one of the things I got for Christmas, but I'm going to be making it here right now. Oh, and I'm, I'm going to... Yeah. This is what it looks like. <laughs> this is all the stuff that we need. So, so, it comes with the clear glue, the sodium tetraborate, it's probably borax, um, a little cup, um, a spoon, a wooden stick, instructions, and the paint. And you're supposed to make rainbow slime with this, but we think that the color may turn out a little gross looking because all these colors together makes brown. So we're going to do the blue and the purple mixed together. No, we're going to do the red and the purple mixed together. Okay, so you're going to need 10 milliliters of hot water. We use this cup to measure it out. And then you're going to need one spoonful of this sodium tetraborate. And mix together until it's dissolved. They said that you need to use hot water so that it will dissolve. Then it says, fill a second cup with 10 milliliters of room temperature water and add in a full bottle of clear glue. Okay, so we're going to pour the 10 milliliters of room temperature water in here. And it's room temperature, so it's a little cold, a little warm. And we're going to put the whole bottle in. Make sure you get try to get all of it. Whoa. So bubbly. And mix together. So I'm going to mix. 